All right, guys, we're live here on YouTube from the Volkswagen Garage. Well, let's come over here to the messy office and get an official time. The official Volkswagen time is about three minutes to ten, if I'm telling that right. Any of you guys seen one of these? This is an actual clock. Apparently this is how they used to keep track of time way back in the day. Hola amigo, como estas Edgar? <laughs> oh, Edgar's, Edgar's my buddy from Jackson. If I invite Edgar down to anything, he is game, man. He's been down here so many times over the last year or so to events and stuff I've uh, invited him to. So this is the project I'm setting up for tomorrow. Got my little bros Yukon in here. We're gonna do a little bit of touch up on it. Rear bumper got crunched. But you guys don't wanna you guys don't wanna see Yukon stuff. You wanna see V dub stuff. Got the uh, oval sitting here, the deluxe. Actually been driving the rusty deluxe today. And uh, do I have any fifties VW vans? Well, Ah, I'm gonna have to scold you first there and say, you know, they didn't make any vans in the 50s for Volkswagen, then they made buses. But uh, just teasing. I do have a 57 uh, in the back room. We can't get to it right now. I don't think my Wi Fi reaches back there. But back in that very back room on the other side of that wall, there is a 1957 uh, 23 window. And then actually, way back in the corner right there, there's a, a 1957 Dove Blue Combi. It's actually stripped down to bare paint right now. But it is, believe it or not, a Dove Blue uh, Combi with a, its original Safari windshield bus that I picked up up in St. Anthony, Idaho years ago for a buddy of mine, Willie. Uh, we, he paid like 800 bucks for it. And I think Willie was 13 or 14 at the time. So uh, that's pretty cool. That's just something. <laughs> I mean, I don't think you can buy a set of Safari windshields for 800 bucks anymore. But anyways, uh, yeah, I just saw a comment. Thanks for the last couple of videos. You bet. Thank you for uh, being patient while I get them uploaded. You know, we did a little trip to uh, we did a trip to Yellowstone Saturday, and uh, we kind of put an invite out there for anybody that wanted to go. Usually, we throw those invites up on. Ah, so we know where two VW pickups are in Superior, Wisconsin. Man, that'd be cool. Send me some photos of them. I'd love to see them. Um, anyways, we went to Yellowstone Saturday. We put the invite out on that on, on our Instagram page. So if you don't follow us on Instagram, head over and check us out on Instagram. It's Volkswear. And then on Facebook, it's Volkswear.com. So, you know, go over and and uh, like our Facebook page, follow our Facebook page. That's where we put out our invites for some of these little get-togethers that we do. Um, we are going to be doing a trip into Grand Teton Park coming uh, up next month. I believe it opens up the 24th. I don't have the dates nailed down just yet. Uh, my buddy Mark and I have been talking about it. Uh, probably get our buddy Jason together and go with him too. Yeah, send me some photos. That'd be great. I appreciate it. Anyways, we're going to head into Grand Teton National Park sometime the end of next month. Probably loop in through the park, maybe camp one night, and then head into Yellowstone. And we're definitely going to be hooking up with Edgar to do this. He's been bugging us to come up to Jackson and uh, do something up that direction. Like I say, Edgar comes down every time I invite him to something. He drives all the way down here from Jackson in his bug and uh, hangs out with us. I wanted to show you guys something. Last week I was gonna do a Facebook, or excuse me, a YouTube live video. And I wanted to, what I was gonna do is it was, I was gonna do a thank you video. Um, I was gonna do a thank you video for, see if I can get in here close enough to see. Basically for 15 million channel views and for 35,000 subscribers, but like I say, that was last week, and I didn't get around to doing that video. And since then, our views have bumped over another million and another 13 or 1,400 subscribers. 
I just wanted to tell you guys thanks. Um, all of you that, that hang in there and, and, and uh, put up with some of my boring videos. And, uh, yeah, everybody come up to Jackson for our trip next month for sure. If you guys are watching this right now and you're not watching it live, if you look over on the right-hand side of the screen, you'll actually see the comments, the live comments dropping down. So when, when all of a sudden I go off on a tangent and I start talking to somebody, that's why. Um, okay, so cruise over here. I want to show you guys this. So in the last 28 days, this is what's called analytics, and we kind of follow these on our Instagram page, or excuse me, our, our YouTube page. 28 days is typically how we're looking at the analytics. So, you know, we've had uh, the likes, you know, almost 10,000, 402 dislikes, which, hey, I, I'm, I'm down for the constructive criticism. <laughs> Clean off some rust. All right. <laughs> Most of my stuff is rusty, but you know what? I've been getting a lot of heat lately on the rusty deluxe. And it's been probably four or five years since we polished that bus. And if you notice down on the front bumper, starting to get some, uh, it's getting pretty rusty. So maybe maybe in the next week or two here, we'll pull the rusty deluxe in and we'll give it a once over. Clean up some of that rust and give it a good polish and wax. But anyways, back to our analytics. Uh, 841 comments. Now these two right here are the ones that I, I just want to tell you guys thanks. This is awesome. So right here, 21,869 shares. You guys, I appreciate you sharing our videos, you know, wherever, embed them in Facebook or just share them wherever. Um, another thing is playlists. You know, on your YouTube channels, you can actually create playlists. And on those playlists, you can embed other people's videos in those playlists. 15,430 of our videos were put into a playlist in the last 28 days. And that helps us out a ton on our views. Um, we've had about 2,422 new subscribers in the last 28 days. And this one right here is the one that is just crazy. We've had 2.1 million views in the last 28 days. And actually a million and a half of those have been in the last week and a half. Uh, the, the field in Colorado. So if you look over to the right, Sigmund Floyd just asked why we didn't pick up the green bug in Colorado. The stuff in Colorado uh, is 17 hours round trip away for me to go get them. And the guys, um, the prices aren't completely outrageous, but they're just way more than I'm, I'm used to paying. So that's why I decided to pass on everything over there. We were trying, kind of had a deal tentatively put together on the three buses the 60 euro and a couple of rag tops but i decided to just pass on the whole thing it was a distraction i've got a lot of things going on right now and i, and I really need to be focusing on stuff here at the shop so i just decided to pass on those so then uh down to the last part of our analytics here 3.6 million minutes of watch time which comes out to be about 61,225 hours in the last 28 days so again i just this was just kind of a I just wanted to give you guys all a big thank you and uh, just tell you how much I appreciate you guys watching. And again, the the, the playlists and, and the shares. If you guys can share our stuff and tell your friends about it, I'm going to try to uh, keep the content coming, keep things interesting. I actually started a video on the 66 here the bus with the safaris up. I've got a video started on that one. And uh, it's it's gonna be a pretty simple video. It's gonna be brakes, it's gonna be um, carb rebuild, and just, I mean, it, a freshen up basically. The bus has been sitting for about uh, three years. So I've got a video going again, you know, sometimes these videos take three or four days, even, even a week or two to, to record all the little bits and pieces for me to then throw together. Um, I do not have, I do not have a video going on this right now, but I need to do one this week. It's been a busy couple weeks and, uh, I need to get the, the single cab out this week and shoot another video probably, uh, yeah, the girls didn't want to go to Yellowstone with me. <laughs> yeah, what's up with that, huh? So the girls actually were going to go to Yellowstone with me. I actually was going to go up and camp 
um, I was going to go camp Friday night. And then the girls said that if I waited and went Saturday morning, they'd go with me. And then it turns out Savannah was actually a little under the weather. And so I just went ahead and, and went on my own and didn't take the girls with me. But uh, so, yeah, guys, again, I'm just rambling at this point. I should probably wrap this up. But uh, it's good talking with you. And again, if you are in the area or you're even thinking about possibly, you know, coming to the area sometime this summer, think about the end of next month, head over to our Facebook page, like that. And uh, she is feeling better. Yeah, she's doing better now. Um, but like our Facebook page, that's where our invite will be to this uh, get together next month. And like I say, we'll probably be meeting up in Jackson. Overseas trips. You know what? I haven't done an overseas trip since probably, gosh, when did I go? I went to, I went to Columbia on a backpacking trip in probably 95. That was my last. I, I don't even know if that counts as overseas. I mean, I flew over a sea to get there, but it probably doesn't really count. As far as overseas, like Europe, I've never been. I'm actually... Uh, not that well traveled a little bit a couple south america trips a couple colombia trips a venezuela trip um yeah check us out on instagram sigmund that's where we'll be posting that stuff so yeah i don't have any overseas trips planned this year i wish i did um the shop keeps me pretty tied down so no overseas trips uh in the immediate future anyway um there is a possibility, I've been talking with a buddy of mine, Jamie, who actually owns this bus. There's a possibility, it's, it's very loosely planned right now, but there's a possibility maybe we're going to do a Columbia, you know, South America, a Columbia trip this year. Go down there and see some friends from when we used to live down there. But that's, uh, like I say, it's a big, it's just a, it's, it's a, a thought right now more than anything. Anyways, guys, I guess I'll wrap this up. I'm just rambling at this point. Again, I appreciate y'all. Appreciate the, yeah, just watching our videos and, and uh, subscribing to our content. And the biggest thing, sharing. Um, take a bus from there to Alaska. Alaska would be a fun trip. All right, guys, so there it is. Thank you for the 16 million channel views and the 36,339 subscribers. And uh, I hope we can just keep it going from here. And uh, yeah, thanks a bunch, guys. Appreciate you watching.